What is up, guys and gals? It is C for the win here, and today I'm with a very special guest. Uh, my name is Skeleton Spooks, and uh, my name is Skeleton Spooks. Yeah, so uh, today we're going to be doing a dual com over some Call of Duty, and it should be right about now starting. Yeah, there we go. And yeah, so I accepted your Springfield challenge. I'm not really sure who made the comment. I'll have to go back and dub that name in or uh, put it over the video. But uh, I did do it, first game, so that's good. <laughs> How well did you do? I forgot. I went 13 and 10, but uh, Skeleton Spooks uh, went did an amazing gameplay. I'm not sure what his grade uh, his grade what his uh, uh score score was. Yeah, uh, but it was really good. It was like at least a three. I'm pretty sure. Mm -hmm. First time I've ever played it in like a year. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it it was a fun time. So it was it was real good. All right. So. Yeah, and so like uh, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna ask C4 the win some questions because this is going to be on both of our channels right mm -hmm. yep and I got some questions to ask you man so uh, why don't you start off with the first one or whatever you got all right so what I wrote down is uh, why did you start YouTube in like the first place what kind of inspired you to do it all right well the first thing that I saw was that was like really inspirational in me was I saw a guy named Nintendo Capri Sun and he does Nintendo Let's Plays and you know personally I watch his videos a lot and um, I've been actually following him for about three years now and I, I was there when he made his Jealous Guy channel but um, I wasn't there mm -hmm. for when it started so that really just sparked my interest when I was a kid and I really kind of waited for myself to kind of mature as a general mm -hmm. thing just because I knew that kids weren't really going to like attract my videos and I knew it was going to take a while so I needed some time to kind of map out in my life to figure out when would be the best to start and yeah so NCS was definitely a huge inspiration for me because he just like always had a good mood and it was it was really good. So yeah. Does he uh, does he still make videos today? Yeah, he's got um, I think he's got close to a hundred thousand subs. Um, and wow. yeah, he's, he's he's I think he's got 19, 1900 videos as of right now. So uh, it's it's really cool. I never really knew him personally, which uh, kind of stunk. But uh, he's kind of like a celebrity to me in a way, and you know, kind of like. And he does like Nintendo gameplays. Yeah, he does uh, Nintendo gameplays. He sometimes does like uh, he did a Plants vs Zombies gameplay, which was pretty recent, and he <laughs> plays a lot of Zelda and stuff like that. So it was it was really cool. Uh, and. Uh... The second one is like, what type of videos slash gameplays do you uh, put up on your channel, specifically for my subs? Ah, uh, yeah. Well, video games that I put up is always whatever my my subscribers or people whoever whoever comments on my video, I will put up a video of if I have the game, and if I don't have the game, I will work on getting the game and post yeah. it because, um, you know, it's always good to see the audience that I have included in the gameplay and. I always ask questions, and I do post a lot of Call of Duty. I post some. I'm going to be posting some Gears and some Halo. Um, I do have a, a wide variety. Also, I did post a couple of Skyrim videos. Um, mm -hmm. They were kind of scrubbish, but that's because I don't. I'm I'm awful at RPGs because I get distracted very easily. So yeah, for for that kind of stuff, it's I, I just post like regular gameplays and whatever kind of comes across my mind. Man, dude, you went on a rampage right there. <laughs> yeah, thanks. The last part. Yeah. Uh, and um, what's your favorite game series of all time, and why? Um, that would actually have to be Pokemon, believe it or not. Really? Uh, yeah, it is. Uh, when I was a kid, back in '96, I think '96 and '97, I mm -hmm. was uh, so into um, Pokemon. Like, I literally spent hours upon hours playing on my Game Boy version one. And it was, uh, it was. I still think I have that in my garage. Yeah, I have like a see-through green one. It's it's really cool, but um, yeah, that that is definitely my favorite series of all time. They've kind of soiled it a little bit, um, with the recent ones because they're so hard to get used to all the names. Um, I actually White and black. Played, I I've I've played through black twice as of right now, and um, it's not one of my favorites. It's it's good, but my favorite. Yeah, I played it for like three hours because you know I'm a big Pokemon fan too. I played it when oh, I was yeah, a little kid. Yeah. yeah. And um, for some reason, like the Pokemon games, I only like like the beginning. Yeah. I only like the where you get to. Once my Pokemon get to level ten, it's just like, uh, <laughs> you know like, what? I'm just yeah. gonna start over and do it again. Yeah, yeah. I, I just like the beginning. I don't know why. Yeah, I always love the challenge of the Elite Four. That's kind of like always been my um, a huge favorite of mine. Just like beating the, fi the like the Elite Four or whoever is in the last, and I'm just like, yes, it's done. It's over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just like that feeling of completion. But you know, I really cared about it too. I remember when I was playing Sapphire when I was just a little kid. 
um, you know, Sapphire, right? Yeah, yeah. My favorite, uh, my favorite one as of right now is uh, Emerald version because I can play that game with like my eyes closed, man. <laughs> I, love, I love all those guys. <laughs> And um, like I was getting near the end of the game, and I was starting to get like really, really um, nervous, cause like I was supposed to get to this place where I'd capture and uh, you know that ancient Pokemon. Yeah. Um, and I was like super yeah. duper excited. And I couldn't get there for some reason. <laughs> I was stuck in the middle of the ocean. Oh man, that's terrible. And uh, I, I, I was so sad. Yeah. I, I didn't play the game since. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. Oh, but I did. I did play the other Pokemon. Yeah, that's no fun when that happens though. Yeah, and do you have some uh, questions for me? Yeah, I do, actually, and that's specifically for my subs. Um, what kind of gameplays do you post, and why do you post them? Um, I usually put up Search and Destroy videos. Like, I'll put up, you know, like, cool gameplays. Like, uh, I can get, you know, like, a, you know, an easy four to five kill death ratio kind of game mm -hmm. pretty easily. Yeah. And I'll usually put that up. Like, recently I put up, like, a commentary about the Xbox 720, and... Every once in a while, I'll do something like where I'll just talk about anything random. But a lot of my videos will be kind of like tactics, and um, especially in Search and Destroy. Because uh, Search and Destroy is like my favorite game type, and I'm like an expert and all that stuff. And yeah, that's pretty much basically what I do. And I do lots of uh, other games like Gears of War. Uh, I put up like a Star Fox 64 Let's Play a couple weeks ago, and I thought that was pretty fun. Yeah. And you know, I, I put up a lot of different stuff. Yeah, um, if you guys want to go see a really good COD player, I definitely suggest Skeleton Spooks. He's, he put up a game where it's 60 and 1. I've never seen scores like that. It's ridiculous. I mean, other than Modern Warfare 2, but I mean, that game was pretty damn broken. But yeah, <laughs> um, yeah so I got one more question for you. Um, what, is, what is your favorite system and why? Um, you know, I, I, I used to be kind of like a fanboy when I was a little kid, mm -hmm. you know, like... Uh, I only like the Xbox because the Xbox was my favorite, you know, it's the, f the one I started playing first, you know? Yeah. And uh, then I kind of grew out of that. Like, I was also like a game fanboy. Like, I only played Halo, you mm -hmm. know, like Halo. If, if I hated Call of Duty. Mm -hmm. And then a year later, I loved Call of Duty and I hated Halo. Yeah. I kind of went through that, like, fanboy phase. Mm -hmm. But now I'm kind of like, no, I don't really care. I, uh, I've been playing, have you heard of Star Wars The Old Republic? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The MMO? Yeah, I've been playing that on the PC yeah. quite a bit. I got like a level 20 Jedi consular. <laughs> That's nice. And, um, uh, I really don't care what P like what game system I play on. I uh, I don't have a PS3 or anything. Only thing I got right now is a uh, Xbox, Nintendo 64, and a GameCube in mm. here. Nice. And um and a PC. And if I could get a PS3, I probably would because it has a Blu-ray player and all that nice mm. stuff. Yeah, PS3s are really expensive, though. I mean, like, I can't yeah. even get around myself to get one. It's it's like I'm trying to save up, but they're so expensive. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really matter what, you know, ex like, console. I'm, yeah. I kind of grew out of that phase of, like, what my favorite console is. But I do like the Xbox quite a bit. Yeah. It's a pretty good game. Yeah, well, I, th I, th I think that actually brings our video to an end, man. I mean, that was pretty good for timing-wise. Yeah. Yeah, well, that's uh, that's pretty decent. Well, thank you so much for being on my channel. And everyone who has not subbed to Skeleton Spooks as of right now, I very highly suggest that you do. And, um, yeah, so... And if you're watching this um, and you're not subbed to both of us, sub to both of us, too. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's always that good. That would be a good idea, too. Yeah. Um, but sub to Skeleton Spooks first. That's, what I, that's the important part. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. That was, that was nice. Peace yeah. out. Peace out.